Why God wants you to wait for the right person for you. Waiting for the right person to come into your life can be difficult. You might feel like you're stuck in limbo, wondering when or if your perfect match will appear. But don't worry, God wants you to wait for the right person. In this video, we'll explore what waiting for God means and why it's important for your happiness. Why God wants you to wait for the right person for you. Many people believe that waiting to find the right person is a waste of time and that you should just go ahead and date whoever you feel like. However, there are many reasons why God wants you to wait for the right person for you. The first reason is that if you wait, you will have a better chance of finding someone who is truly compatible with you. Waiting also allows the relationship to develop at its own pace and avoids rushing into anything without knowing all of the facts. When two people are in a hurry, they often end up making mistakes that can damage their relationship. Another reason to wait is because sometimes people are not ready when we think they are. Many times we think someone is ready for us, but in reality, they may not be. We need to give people time to grow and change, and waiting gives them that opportunity. It's also important to remember that not everyone is going to be compatible from the start. Sometimes it takes time for two people to grow together. So, waiting isn't always a bad thing. In fact, it can be very beneficial. The important thing is to remember why God wants you to wait for the right person for you. The benefits of waiting for the right person. Waiting for the right person is a wise decision because it can lead to a more rewarding relationship. Here are five reasons why waiting for the right person is beneficial. Number one, you'll have a better connection with them. When you're first dating someone, you're often caught up in the moment and not paying as much attention to their personality. As time goes on, you'll develop a deeper connection with the person if you wait for the right one. This will give you a better understanding of who they are and what they're interested in, which will make your relationship stronger. Number two, you'll have more control over your relationship. If you wait for the right person, you'll have more control over the type of relationship that you have. If you're in a hurry to get married or have kids, chances are you won't be as happy in your relationship later on. By waiting, you can choose to date someone who's compatible with your lifestyle and values. Number three, you'll find someone who's truly worth your time. When you're first dating someone, there's always a risk that they won't be worth your time in the long run. Waiting allows you to find someone who is truly worth your time and who you'll want to be with for the long haul. Number four, you'll have a better chance of finding someone you really connect with. When you're first dating someone, your emotions are usually running high. This means that you might not be as observant of their personality as you should be. If you wait for the right person, you'll have a better chance of finding someone who shares your values and interests. This will make your relationship stronger than if you had chosen someone based on superficial factors. Number five, you'll prevent yourself from making mistakes later on. When you're in a hurry, it's easy to make mistakes when dating. For example, you might commit too soon or rush into things without thinking things through. Waiting allows you to take your time and get to know the person better before making any decisions. So in summary, the five reasons why waiting for the right person is beneficial are as follows. You'll develop a deeper connection with the person. You'll have more control over your relationship. You'll find someone who's truly worth your time. You'll have a better chance of finding someone you really connect with. And finally, you'll prevent yourself from making mistakes later on. So how do you know when it's time to settle down? There are a lot of factors to consider when it comes to finding the right person for you. Many people want to find someone who is perfect for them, but that's not always realistic. You may also be wondering when you should settle down and get married. Here are six things to keep in mind if you want to wait for the right person. 1. You don't have to settle for someone who isn't a good fit for you. Just because someone is a good match on paper doesn't mean they will be a good fit in person. It's important to find someone who you can connect with on an emotional level as well. Two, don't rush into anything. If you haven't dated seriously in a while, it can be hard to know if you are ready to enter into a serious relationship again. Sometimes it's best to take your time and see if the right person comes along. Three, don't put too much pressure on yourself. Marriage is a big commitment and it shouldn't be taken lightly. Making this decision should be something that feels right for both you and your partner. 4. It's okay to take your time when it comes to finding the right person. If you feel like you are ready, there is no harm in dating around a little bit. However, if you aren't interested in any of the people you are dating, 
it may be best to focus your energy on finding someone specific. 5. Don't expect everything to happen overnight. Marriage isn't a throwaway decision, it should be something that is valued and cared for. You should both be willing to put in the work required to make it work. 6. Make sure you are both on the same page when it comes to marriage. If one of you is planning on getting married quickly because they think the other is not ready, this could lead to problems down the road. Both of you should have an agreement about what kind of relationship you want and what kind of marriage is best for you both. Now let's talk about the signs that you're ready to find your soulmate. Waiting can be a difficult decision, but it can be one of the most rewarding things you'll ever do. Here are four reasons why God wants you to wait for the right person. 1. Waiting gives you time to grow and develop as a person. When you're in a hurry, you may not give yourself enough credit. You might think, I can't be choosy because I don't have much time. But if you wait, you'll find that you've actually gained some skills and knowledge that will make you a better partner for someone else. 2. Waiting gives you a chance to get to know the person better. When two people are in a hurry, they usually end up communicating in superficial ways. They talk about the weather or their jobs, but they rarely get to know each other on a deeper level. If you wait though, you'll have the opportunity to really get to know the person, what makes them laugh, what they like to do for fun, and so on. This type of knowledge is invaluable when it comes to finding compatibility with someone else. 3. Waiting builds trust. When we rush into things, we tend to take risks that we wouldn't take if we had more time. We might not be as honest with each other, or we might not trust each other completely. If you wait though, you can build a much more trusting relationship with the person you're interested in. 4. Waiting may lead to a deeper connection. When two people are in a hurry, they often end up communicating superficially because they don't have enough time to get to know each other on a deeper level. But when two people wait, they may end up developing a much stronger connection than if they had just rushed into things. This kind of connection is built on trust and understanding, which are key ingredients for a successful relationship. What is God's plan for you? God has a plan for your life, and it does include waiting around for the right person to come along. In fact, you were designed specifically for someone, and they were designed specifically for you. When you find that person, know that they are exactly what you've been looking for. They will make your heart sing and fulfill all of your deepest desires, the importance of trust and honesty. There is a saying that goes, if it's not broken, don't fix it. This is often cited when referring to relationships, and it is a great motto to live by. A good relationship is built on trust and honesty. Without these two fundamentals, a relationship can quickly crumble. Trust is the cornerstone of any healthy relationship. When we trust someone, we allow them into our heart and mind. We give them the freedom to hurt us, but also the opportunity to help us. We place our faith in their ability to keep their word and do what they say they will do. Honesty is just as important in a relationship as trust. It allows us to be ourselves without fear of being judged or rejected. Honesty allows us to be transparent with one another and build a deeper connection. If we are always lying to one another, it destroys the trust that was so hard to build in the first place. The importance of trust and honesty cannot be overstated in a relationship. These are the two foundations upon which all other relationships are built. If you want a healthy, lasting relationship, make sure you build these qualities into your relationship from the beginning. Waiting for the right one. Waiting for the right person can be hard, but it is something that God wants us to do. Waiting for the right person is a process that starts with recognizing when we are not in our own best interest. We need to be patient and open to meeting new people, even if we don't feel that spark yet. It is important to remember that God has a plan for our lives, and He will bring us into relationships that are perfect for us. Waiting for the right person is a process that takes time and effort, but is worth it in the end. Relationship advice for those who are ready to commit. If you're in a relationship and you feel like it's time to take the next step, but you're not sure if the person you're with is the right one for you, there are a few things you can do to figure out if it's really time to move on. First, make sure that you both have the same goals and values. If one of you is looking for a long-term relationship while the other is only interested in a casual fling, it won't work out. Second, make sure that your relationship is healthy. If either of you is struggling with anxiety or depression, 
It's not going to be healthy for either of you to get married or stay in a relationship where there are constant fights. Finally, make sure that your timing is right. If you're ready to commit to someone but they aren't ready yet, waiting isn't going to do either of you any good. There are plenty of other people out there who would be perfect for you and who will appreciate all the time and effort that you're putting into your relationship. Let's look at the proper perspective on waiting. Waiting is a difficult concept to wrap our heads around. We're so used to instant gratification that it feels wrong to put in the extra effort required for something lasting. But waiting is key to finding the perfect person for you. It's not about settling. Settling means you're happy with what you have and you're not looking for anything better. Waiting is about taking your time, being patient, and seeing if the person is truly compatible with you. Settling means that you're not living in the present and you're not taking into consideration what could be better for you. Settling isn't always bad, but it's important to be cautious. It can lead to disappointment if the person you're waiting for doesn't show up or if he or she ends up being someone who isn't compatible with you. When you wait, your chances of finding the right person are increased because you won't be rushed into anything. You'll have plenty of time to get to know each other and see if there's a connection between you two. There are a few things to keep in mind when waiting. Don't rush into anything. Don't get attached to the idea of the person you're waiting for and be patient. The proper perspective on waiting is that it is a difficult concept to wrap our heads around. We are so used to instant gratification that it feels wrong to put in the extra effort required for something lasting. Waiting is key to finding the perfect person for you though, and it isn't about settling. Settling means you're happy with what you have and you're not looking for anything better. Waiting is about taking your time, being patient, and seeing if the person is truly compatible with you. Settling isn't always bad, but it's important to be cautious. It can lead to disappointment if the person you're waiting for doesn't show up or if he or she ends up being someone who isn't compatible with you. When you wait, your chances of finding the right person are increased because you won't be rushed into anything. You'll have plenty of time to get to know each other and see if there's a connection between you two. There are a few things to keep in mind when waiting, don't rush into anything. Don't get attached to the idea of the person you're waiting for and be patient. When it comes to relationships, there is always a risk of getting hurt. It's human nature to want what we can't have and to jump into things prematurely. We want to believe that the right person is out there for us and we don't want to wait. However, waiting can be the best thing for you. First of all, if you're not sure if you're ready for a relationship, then it's probably not the right time for you. Secondly, waiting will give you a better understanding of what you really want in a partner. Thirdly, waiting gives you more time to find someone who is compatible with you. Lastly, waiting will allow you time to develop a strong connection with the person you are dating. Waiting allows for more intimacy and trust because it shows that both parties are serious about wanting a relationship. Waiting can be difficult, but it is a necessary step in finding the right person for you. We all have different needs and wants, which means that not every person out there is going to be perfect for us. It's important to take the time to find someone who meets all of your needs, not just some of them. If you're patient enough, God will bless you with the perfect partner who will make your life complete. May God help you in Jesus' name. Amen.